Hello and welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from DataLearner.com and in today's video tutorial, we are going to be looking at Binance features. Alright, so I'll be showing you in this video why you should be trading with Binance features and not just that, at the end of the day, the second part of the video will be how you can actually start growing from a hundred dollar to about a thousand dollars to two thousand dollars and even more if you follow the step-by-step -step guide that I'm going to show you in this video. All right. So if you are new to this channel and you love videos about making money online, about crypto trade and investing, then consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel. All right. And if you gain any value from this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. All right. So that um, others can actually be benefiting from it as well. So um, this video is going to be divided into two parts, all right? So the first part will be I will be showing you reasons why you should be actually uh, Why you should consider trading um, features with Binance, all right? And then the second part will be the practical aspect of it how um, Where I'm going to show you the settings you need to make to your features account and how to start ripping and growing a little amount to a very substantial amount trading features, all right? All right, so to proceed, I want you to know the difference, okay, between spots and then futures trading, all right? Because um, traders often ask these questions, okay? Um, which market is better to trade? Is it spot um, trading or futures trading? Well, if you ask me that question, the simple answer to give you is trade spot market if you are looking to make a longer term investment, all right? Um, and the reason for this is because with spot trading, you don't really lose money. You don't really lose money because you have your money, okay, and you buy a particular crypto asset, you have access to that asset. Let's say you buy one Bitcoin today at $30,000, you still have one bit, one Bitcoin, even if the price drops to $20,000, all right? And that is why the wash word here, which is the longer term investment is key here, okay? So since you have in mind that you want to go into a long-term investment, there is every tendency that you can hold that for a period of a, let's say half a year, a year, two or three, before the price can actually either double or even triple what you bought it, right? In that case, you can sell and make and take a, um, profit, all right? But if you want to be making daily profit from the market, if you want um, to use um, leverage, okay? If you want to edge the market, all right, against spot trading, then the best option to do is to trade futures, all right? And these are reasons why you should consider trading futures, all right, with Binance futures, all right? So a few of the reasons I'm going to list here with the benefit are reasons why I want you to start trading futures. If you don't have a Binance account already, then link will be in the video description to sign up for an account. Okay, you can sign up for an account using the link in the video description and start benefiting from this. All right. Now, one thing I want you to know is that you can use futures trading as an edge against um, spot market. All right. You use futures trading as an edge against um, spot um, market. All right. And Binance enables you to use these features of edging. All right. No, it though by default, I'll be showing you that in the second part of the video where I need to demonstrate it. By default, the Binance Futures Trading Account is set to a one-way trading mode, all right? It is set to a one-way a one trading mode, but I will show you how you can actually um, change it from the one-way trading mode to the edging mode to be able to benefit from that. And what are the reasons why you want to edge the market, okay? Um, with edging mode on the Binance Exchange, you can buy or long the market, okay? Or sell or short the market at the same time. All right, you can open a long position and open a short position at the same time. Okay, and the reason for doing this is because you can use edging to secure or protect profit. All right, and another reason is that it, you can use this particular edging to actually make a short term massive gain from the futures market. Okay, and all of this can be done using the Binance Exchange. All right. So here is a little illustration to help you understand what edging is all about with the Binance um, exchange. OK, so let's say you decided to long the market. OK, you decided to go long on the market. And as at the time you entered the market, Bitcoin price was uh, around fifty thousand dollars. All right. So you enter the market, you long the market at fifty thousand and then 
um, within a short period of time, Bitcoin actually grew from $50,000 to $60,000, all right? So in this case, you have made about $10,000 profit, right? So you have made $10,000 profit. But because of how volatile the crypto market is, there is every tendency that at $60,000, it can still be dropping. And let's say you are very sure that this price will continue to scale up. It can go above 60000 or 70000 and above. And then you want to maintain that long position. The next thing you want to do is to apply this edging. All right. Once you activate it on your Binance account, you can open both positions. Okay. That is what I said in the first um, benefit of edging the market. Okay. So once it has 60000 and then you want to secure or protect your profit, then all you just need to do is to go short. All right. At 60000 you can go short okay so when you go short and then the price drops from sixty thousand to ten um to fifty thousand okay the short position two will be making um ten thousand dollars profit for you while the long position two will be losing um ten thousand dollars so in this case whichever way you look at it you are still in profit all right even if it goes um below forty thousand the short position two will still be locking up your profit for you okay why the long position too so when you look at it from the real sense is that it, using edging the edging mode you are not losing money at all okay so that is one of the reasons why you should consider trading with binance all right so another reason why you should consider using the binance futures trading is market neutral trading strategies and this is made possible because of the edging that is um, made available okay um, now because of edging when you're trading futures in general okay what you should know that in general is that when it comes to futures trading you don't really need to bother whether we are in a bullish market or we're in a bearish market or whether the market is stagnant okay because um the volatility nature of the market can actually make you make a lot of gain within a short period of time okay when the market will between the ups and down and that is if only you know what you're doing i'll be showing you all of this and how to implement the strategies um, in the second part of this video all right so another reason you should be looking at trading features is because of leverage right because of leverage and what leverage does is it helps you to actually increase your profit by default okay leverage helps you to increase your profit by de default and what leverage simply means is that you are trading with borrowed funds okay as a trader if you have an account balance of let's say a hundred dollar all right you could actually use 10x leverage and borrow nine hundred dollars when you're using 10x leverage you can borrow up to nine hundred dollars okay to enter a long or short position worth one thousand dollars so with your hundred dollars and you're using 10x leverage it means that you can open a position whether long or short worth a thousand dollars so in this case if the market increased by one percent instead of making one percent of one hundred dollar in this case you'll be making one percent of what a thousand dollars all right so if it increases by ten percent instead of making um ten percent of your hundred dollar you'll be making ten percent of a thousand dollars and this because of leverage you have the ability to actually um double or triple or you know even get like 100 percent return 1000 percent return within a short period of time and all of these are made possible when you are trading features only all right so that is what um, one thing i want you to equally have in mind all right so here are a few benefits i need you to have in mind okay there are a lot of them why you should be trading with binance but these are the few ones that i decided to highlight here before we go into the details okay number one is that when it comes to crypto trading okay when it comes to trading derivative binance is the king of crypto derivatives all right binance is the king because um binance is presently trusted by over 28 million active users all right active users means that these are people who use the binance exchange every now and then in terms of trading buying and selling um you know building up their portfolio these 28 million people are the ones okay binance is the that is why it is the king because it is it has the highest users when it comes to crypto trading investing and building up your portfolio all right so another reason you should be looking at is low fees okay um when it comes to trading crypto you don't want to be like the language my people normally use monkey they work bamboo they shop okay you don't want to be like that 
you don't want to make profit and at the end of the day you pay everything into fee that is another reason why you should consider trading with binance features because of their low fee and it is even more lower if you are holding bnb or busd which is the native um bnb is the native token of the binance exchange and then the busd is the stable coin of the binance exchange okay so if you are holding any of this you pay a lower fee as against um normal okay so another reason you should be looking at or one of the, another benefit is that binance has the largest trading volume okay so when a market is doing very well it depends on their trading volume okay for instance if you go to coin market cap um the ranking you see there are based on their trading volume the more money we have in a particular asset the better that can do and binance has the highest trading volume and that is what makes it outstanding all right so another reason you should be looking at is that you have over 500 trading pairs that you can choose from all right when it comes to trading features you have over 500 trading pairs that you can choose for you can choose from on the binance um features trading option all right so um the next reason or the next benefit here is because of binance their highest is because of their highest liquidity okay when we talk of high liquidity when a particular asset has high liquidity or an agent has a high liquidity it saves you from um you know the consequences of slippage okay let's say you have a hundred thousand dollars you want to invest in a particular asset and then you place a limit order or a market order to buy because of slippage okay when the liquidity on that exchange um, is very low because of slippage that order will not be filled at once okay let's say you have um, um instructed the exchange to buy at uh, let's say fifty thousand now because of low liquidity it will split it okay some can buy at 50 some can buy at 51 some can buy at 52 and it goes on like that okay but because of the high liquidity of the binance exchange you don't really need to bother about this because all of your trade can be filled um at a very short period of time all right so very fast as well okay and then the other one i have here is because of the enterprise grade security so with binance exchange you are sure that your funds are secure all right binance even have an insurance okay for the they are all the users okay for the users phones that they have on their exchange all right so these are basically some of the reasons you should be looking at these are some of the things you should be looking at before actually trusting a particular exchange with your funds and i believe with all of these reasons i've given you binance actually worth it and trading features can actually help you go a long way all right so now to go into the practical aspect of it i've said from the beginning that you can actually with features trading you can actually grow a hundred dollar to a lot a substantial amount of money all right so um i'll be showing you how to actually set up your binance um, S, um features trading account and how you can get started and that is what we are doing in the next part all right so once you log into your account okay you want to go to be able to access the features trading interface you want to go to access derivatives from the menu here and then you go to usdt m features okay so we'll have usd m features and then we'll have coin m features the difference between these two is that with usdt you need to have usdt okay to be able to trade while with the coin features you need to have your funds in either bitcoin ethereum and the rest to be able to trade okay so on the usdt m features if you are trading with usdt you get settled in usdt why on the coin m future if you trade with bitcoin or ethereum whatever coin you are trading with that is the token or the coin you'll be tra you'll be actually um settled with okay so you come in here and click on it so let me just go ahead and click on that all right so once you click on that interface or that option it brings you to this interface okay so this is where we are going to be carrying out our trade and the first thing i want you to do okay is to change because by default the features trading um comes with the one-way trading mode okay so you want to change it to edging remember what i told you about edging okay you can open a long position and then a short position at the same time all right in order to secure your profit okay so to be able to do that what we need to do here is to actually um come in here okay to this option you see this option here down here okay so i'll come in here click on it and then when i click on it i want to go to where it says preferences okay so i'll click on preferences and when this dialog box pops up 
you want to go to position mode okay click on position mode and by default it is on this one-way mode okay so we want to change it from one-way mode to edging mode okay so just go ahead and click on that and that has been changed okay so it says our um, position has been adjusted successfully and that is it so here what it simply means is that we can open a long position and open a short position at the same time all right so basically the way i use agent um particularly um is when i want to open a, a position okay um some do it immediately but i don't do it immediately okay when i'm sure of the market i want to trade that is going the direction of the market i want to trade okay if it is to open long position i open a long position and then when it is in profit okay in order to secure that profit and don't and lose money entirely i'll come back again and open a short position okay let's say i have made 200 dollars profit um, 100 dollars 500 or a thousand dollars profit okay i can open a short position all right to uh, hold that position maybe when the market is going down right if i notice that market is going to go against me i'll open a short position okay so why that is going down this can be making profit this can be losing okay and then when it reverses i can go ahead and equally um you know take um profit from this other one and it goes on like that okay so now that we've changed it to the edging mode you can see here we have open long and then we have the open short okay and we are on the cross mode now if you're a beginner and you're trading crypto please don't trade with cross mode okay always go with isolated when i trade with cross mode your rigs and um, all of the account balance you have on your futures account okay and then if you're trading with isolated is only that money um, that you have okay if you if you are risking hundred dollars you know that it's only hundred dollars you are risking in um in a case where you get liquidated it is only that hundred dollars you lose but when you get liquidated on a cross margin okay you your whole account balance will go all right so that is it and to show you that this is possible i can go ahead and the edging mode is poss possible of opening a long and short position two at the same time i can go ahead and click on the um let's say we want to trade about uh, one btc okay if i want to trade one btc i can go ahead and put in one btc here um for the purpose of this demonstration right let me just show you that i can put in one btc and um, go ahead and use the market order okay so i'm using market order so i'll go ahead and open um, a long position okay and then at the same time i will put in one btc and open a short position all right so if i come down here you see we have long position okay why this is in profit this is at loss okay so if i close this all right because here is making me 27 and then this is making me minus 25 so if i close this in one way or the other i'll still be in profit all right so i'll still be in profit um in this all right so that is possible because we just changed switch the account from one way mode to um the the, the edging mode okay so that is another thing and the next thing i want you to take note here is leverage using leverage okay i'm using one on um, 100x leverage okay depending on the token you are trading for instance with btc i can go um, up to 125x leverage okay but as a beginner always trade between 1x to 10x okay remember the demonstration i gave about um, um trading with a hundred dollars okay so with a hundred dollars you can borrow up to a thousand dollars right you can open a position worth a thousand dollars because hundred dollars gives you access with 10x leverage you can you know borrow like uh, 900 dollars and you can open a position worth a thousand dollars okay with that whatever profit you make from this um platform you can keep if it is one percent so you are sure that you're making um one percent profit of um a thousand dollars as against your initial hundred dollars which is your balance all right so trading features with um binance is a good thing all right it is a way of making um small small profit from the market all right so with it you can actually start growing your portfolio your crypto portfolio while you wait for your long-term investment to appreciate all right so futures trading is one of the best things that can happen to anybody out there so one thing i want you to note here is actually it cost me for opening one btc okay it cost me the margin it cost me is 384 all right that is what it cost me to 389 dollars to open each of this position okay um that is what it cost me and that is because i am using cross and then 100x leverage okay so to just show you what you should be expecting is i can change from this okay 
um, let's say I'll go back here and go to Ethereum. Okay, let me go to Ethereum because I have position running on BTC already. I can adjust that. Okay, so on the Ethereum here, I can come in and change the leverage. Okay, to like 10x. So if I change it to 10x, I'll go ahead and confirm that. All right. So and I'm trading with isolated mode. Okay, this is what I recommend for any um, newbie out there. Okay. So here on the Ethereum, let's say I want to trade one Ethereum. Okay. On Ethereum, one thing I want you to note is how much it will cost you to actually open that position with 10x leverage. You see here, under the open long, you see where it says cost, whether you want to open long or short. You see, this is what it's going to cost you, okay? So if I go and remove that one and put 0 0.01, for instance, okay? If I put 0 0.01, it will cost me $2, two um, uh, dollars, okay? And then if you put like 0 0.01, it will cost you $25, okay? So this is what will be your own margin in this case, okay? So you always take note of this cost before you open any position. This is what it will cost you, all right? So this is what it will cost you. And then you can go ahead and put in your take profit and stop loss. Let's say you want to take profit when the market gets there, um, gets to a certain price and the rest. You can specify all of that here. So I just wanted you to note this, okay? that uh, it will cost you so, 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 so amount using your number of leverage and the isolated mode okay so that is it for this video i hope you enjoyed the video if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you have any issue leave a, um, a comment using the comment section below and then um, if you want to learn more about trading okay you want to join our daily zoom meetings then link to join the telegram group where the zoom link is posted will be in the video description to do that once again if you don't have an account with binance link to sign up an account will probably be in the video description all right so if you like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share with others that is it for this video and i'll see you guys in the next video